are the faces of Michigan's 2015 Governor's Fitness Award winners. They're dreamers. My dream is to be the world champion in table tennis. And they're doers. I lost 390 pounds in 18 months. Oh my gosh! <laughs> my name is Nate Young. I've lost 250 pounds and I've conquered obesity. I believe that I can do anything. But mostly, they are inspiration. I was so obese that I could barely walk. Now I'm running. They're champions for health. Who wants to wobble, baby? <laughs> Just to watch somebody else succeed and know you had a hand in doing that, best thing ever. Always comparing ourselves to somebody else, we're never gonna be able to shine and become the best version of ourselves that we can. They're changing lives. Just reach fingertips up towards the scene. I'm not afraid of living anymore. Five, six, seven, eight. Hopefully this will encourage women to turn their lives around and their families' lives around. Cha-cha right. Cha cha left and rock. Two, three, four. They're finding the finish line. There's people that are just watching me on the course and they don't know that I have Asperger's. And they're just saying, wow, I wish I could run as fast as him. My mom is my role model and she's amazing. And she's to hear her say, I'm so proud of you, and hug me. And then my little niece take my medal and say, Aunt Lizzie, you won the race. They've created Michigan's most extraordinary events. Therefore, I, George J. Hartwell, Mayor of the City of Grand Rapids, do hereby proclaim April 13th, 2013, as the Gazelle Girl Half Marathon and 5K Race Day. We bring people together of all ability levels, get them out and being active, and just give them the support that they need to get out and change their lives. Creating fitness memories that'll last forever. It's gonna be something that I remember for the rest of my life, doing 60 on 60 with my dad. And creating work environments and communities committed to health and wellness. There's a 14 year old who gave his brother a piggyback ride for 40 miles to raise awareness of cerebral palsy. The first time I thought about that, it was pretty insane. And a police officer, nearly killed trying to save a life, who honors a fallen officer by getting out of her wheelchair and I actually did the 5K on my crutches. I remember that day very well. <laughs> She's inspired a lot of people, not just Mama, um, but inspired others to, to do better, to, to do more than they think they can. They are unstoppable. Losing my legs and losing my vision has given me an incredible opportunity. If, if you're just a regular veteran, you're, you're messing out. Wounded veterans still physically giving their all. To me, it's just an honor to be able to be there for my country and for my brothers. My biggest thing is, is never giving up, never quitting. Congratulations to Michigan's 2015 Governor's Fitness Award nominees.